the game before Leningrad. John, would you say that really is going to be it, and he, it'll find, he'll find it very difficult to get back, even in his home country? Well, I think in this case, I will give you a positive statement. If he loses another game, that will be it. Right, well, we'll have to see whether he does. John Nunn and Sheila Jackson, thank you both very much indeed. Well, now, I have a little prediction of my own. My prediction is that this game, whatever our two worthies have said, and whatever the possibilities of an intricate and elegant endgame emerging from it, is going to be a draw. And my reason is this, that I have it on very good authority that Kasparov, uh, Gary Kasparov, has a ticket for tomorrow's game between Arsenal and Manchester United. And on balance, after the last two games, I know which one I'd choose between that and a game of chess. But, but there we are. No odds for you, I'm afraid, tonight, although I'm sure this evening's play hasn't made the slightest iota of difference. Uh, of course, as you know, it's bank holiday weekend. Nevertheless, we shall be here and working, and we'll be back on Monday night with the report on the next game and, indeed, what happened to this one. But also some other news, because we've had a lot of fun behind the scenes getting behind the scenes of this intriguing international game, and I can tell you that some of the stories that come out behind the chessboard are arguably even more intriguing than some of the action on the board. Those stories we've collated together, along with... Top information from top stars like Victor Korchnoi, the Leningrad Lip, as they call him, and that will be in our special program on Tuesday afternoon at 2.30. So at least two dates for you. Monday night to join us again, Tuesday afternoon, for our special program on the politics of chess. Until Monday, have a good weekend, and from all of us, goodbye. <laughs>
as far as I can gather, the Beatles lately. The Beatles? <laughs> That's all I can think of. You know the Beatles. I love you. I'll always be true. So please love me, do. Thank <laughs> you.